Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Blank Check here, and today, the world is on fire. There are various levels of lockdown as COVID-19 makes its way across the globe. Things will get worse before they get better. And all I can really do right now is make a dumb horse video. And also say, be cautious, but don't panic. Wash your hands and don't hoard toilet paper. So with that all said, a new Forgalorga video came out. Those are nice and easy. This is Princess Twilight Sparkle. Not sure if this is a follow-up to his mainline. He has made Princess Starlight Glimmer before, and we have this giant alternate reality through line going on. So it could be some exciting addition to that, or just a sequence of cute little vignettes of our favorite winged book horse ruling Equestria. There's a, a very large gap of time between Season 9 Episodes 25 and 26, so maybe Forga wants to fill in some details. That should be fine. Ladies and gentlemen, let's take a small break from the world. How to Be a Princess? That's my favorite book! I've read it six times! That's how I'm so good at being one. I gotta pick a crown, number one. I would... Love to see what Twilight looked like with that, uh, Balzette crown. I don't even know what the effects of that are. Oh. If the crown fits, Twilight, you already got the perfect one. That's a good plan. That's what, oh yeah, Celestia's plan. Call Twilight. <laughs> Man, I wish there was a, was there a Kraken technically? I don't remember in the, the pirate Applejack episode. Can't remember if that was a Kraken or not. <laughs> I control the troops. <laughs> That's a, uh... Forga's meme job on point in this video. The equestrian general. Oh, it's so tidy. Twilight's back in the, uh, revolution. That's some straight-up, top-quality, 16th-century battlegrounds you got there. Uh, Twilight, you're supposed to dip it. Dip it, why would you take one bite? Oh, that's other magic. Stop replacing my cookies! I want the full cookie experience. You can't deprive me of that. Maybe the servants were, uh, uh, selling those partially in cookies on Nay Bay. e -nay? <laughs> <laughs> That kid's been through a lot over these past uh, couple months as Twilight Rules. Seen the horrors that she's wrought. I don't want to... I keep wanting to, like, mention specific political things as examples, but I'm afraid of stoking some kind of fire. That's a long cord. Haven't y'all gotten cell phones yet? I- that is a- are those nine Roombas? With a piece of cardboard on top? Because that's actually a genius idea the official Twilight Throne. Oh, it's, uh, Sun O'Clock. Time to get up. Really, Twilight, you really need to find a way to automate this. You know, maybe just make Equestria round and then start spinning Equestria instead of the Sun and Moon. Nah, that's dumb. Yeah! Wait. Is that the put the moon up one? Does she need two separate alarm clocks for the roughly the same time of day? Ah, Twilight has exited the building. Yeah, entered the, the dreamscape of Luna's previous job. You know, zero contact, very sanitary job. Yeah, I love it. What a great job. 
I hope she's accruing a nice 401k for this. I wonder how the healthcare is. <laughs> Dear Twilight, my sister and I are having a wonderful time. We've never been closer or more happy. Anyway, hope the princess thing works out. Celestia. Alright, time to burn this castle to the ground. This is why you need to delegate. There, finally, your pawns. Think of all the work they can get done underneath you. Yeah, you have friends, lackeys. Not sure how far in the future this one is. I am the princess now. <laughs> hey, finders keepers. That's a five second rule on the crown twilight. Not sure if that, uh, the timeline here was, you know, directly after the finale or the pre time jump finale and her friends are off doing their own thing, but maybe this was part of the remembrance timeline secretly. If that's the case, that's sad. I'm sorry, Twilight. If it's not, get off your butt and rule Equestria properly, you dumb book horse. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that was Princess Twilight Sparkle from Forga Lorga, and that one was surprisingly wholesome. It feels like Forga accidentally clicked upload to the wrong channel. This one was meant to go to Agrol. Without any shenanigans from Alicorn Starlight, things are relatively normal. And it closed on a pretty warm note of Twilight thinking about her friends. Just a nice, straightforward video about Twilight's managerial heck. The average day-to-day -day troubles of being a one-horse princess who apparently does not delegate enough. And props to Celestia, she did a great job in conning this little purple pony into accepting all of her old responsibilities. Anyway, this was fun and a nice respite from our day-to-day -day concerns. Speaking of everyone watching this, I hope you're doing fine under these circumstances. I hope your families are doing fine. There's a lot of uncertainty right now and best wishes are really all I can give. So be careful, especially if you're in an impacted area and hopefully things will pass sooner rather than later. So until next time, ladies and gentlemen, remember, stop touching your face. No, stop it. Hey, don't put that finger there. Don't do that. Stop.